We're going to turn to the White House now, where President Obama is preparing to announce a major shift in the war on terror. Later this morning, he's going to lay out new limits on drone strikes against terrorist targets and a new push to close the prison holding suspected terrorists at Guantanamo. We see John Carl's here with the details. And John, the president has been struggling with this for some time. He sure has, George. You know, the president has relied heavily on drone strikes to kill terrorists around the world. But now he's going to talk about the need to be more public about that, to let the public know more about what is happening in this highly secretive program. He is also going to talk about new limits that he has already put into place on the use of drone strikes. George, these are limits that will apply to him and to future presidents. As part of this effort to be open, he also acknowledged yesterday the administration that they have killed four Americans tied to Al Qaeda with drone strikes over the the past couple of years. And what about Guantanamo? The president promised to close at the very beginning of his first term, hadn't made any progress at all. What's new here? This is one of the president's greatest frustrations. He is going to again urge Congress to close Guantanamo. He needs Congress to do it. In the meantime, he is going to talk about speeding up the transfer of at least some of those prisoners back to their home countries. That's something that started under President Bush, but has stalled recently. Hey, John, thanks very much.